I'm very excited about new paradigms of treatment, treatments that may be rapid acting, and treatments that may work with a very short period of treatment and not be required to be continued over the long term. One of those that's currently in development that I'm interested in is SAGE 217, which is a GABA-A agonist, uh, an allosteric modulator that is uh, in development for major depression. So depression itself causes sexual dysfunction in about 70% of individuals with depression. And it can vary what type, whether it's low desire or difficulty getting aroused or, or even not being able to have an orgasm or other pleasure. So if you treat a person with depression with an antidepressant, if their depression gets into remission, then the sexual dysfunction that was associated with the depression itself may therefore very well improve. If you have somebody who has sexual dysfunction as a symptom of their depression, you treat them with an antidepressant like an SSRI, and all their other symptoms of depression get better, but not their sexual dysfunction, then that may very well be a side effect, a sexual side effect of the SSRI or antidepressant therapy and needs to be addressed a bit differently.